interesting. Yeah, so let's now go into comparisons of all of these wireless uh, sensors, right? We can dive into some specific hardware devices that we tested. I know that we tested a bunch of them. And uh, yeah, perhaps yeah. let's cover, yeah, Laura and Zigbee. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah let, let, let's uh, start from the short story of our company. So we're doing uh, water leak detection system more than two years. So we have uh, some expertise and uh, at the beginning, we start from the Zigbee. So yeah. why we start from it? Because, uh, you know, uh, the sensors are pretty cheap. You have different varieties of them. Uh, they have uh, enough uh, battery life. So you can like uh, install a sensor and forgot about it for two, three years based on the uh, type of the device or, of uh, uh, you use. Uh, but uh, the main problem with them um, is uh, distance. So, for example, if you install them to the uh, some um, big apartments, uh, they just won't work for your case. Uh, Zigbee uh, allow you to like cover maybe I don't know 100 square meters apartment at max. And uh, it won't work, I think, stable, better it's half to 15 meters, square meters. No, it's including walls and all other things. It's like real metric scenarios. Yeah, and also depending on the wall structure, right? Because there are different apartments with different, yeah. In so any you need, case, to, you need to really test it on site, right? To exactly. select. Exactly, because without it, uh, you can't predict uh, how a uh, signal goes from this wall to this wall. So there are like a special devices which allow you to understand uh, signal strange between your gateway and mm -hmm. uh, location. Uh, also, like, uh, no, so uh, this is a cheap technology, pretty simple and uh, mm. Uh, good for the scenarios when you have like a personal small apartment, it will work good. But if you want to have centralized and clear detection system on huge building, uh, it's uh, not your choose. Uh, but it's pretty cheap. And uh, for example, let's see, uh, you can use like uh, Zigbee gateways are very cheap, uh, sensors very cheap. Uh, but uh, in the huge like apartments, you will need uh, to install them too much, and it won't become such cheap solution. So you never uh, you need to plan it on them on the your exact building. Uh -huh. yeah. uh, so after that, after we have some issues with Zigbee, we start using Quora. Now it's I think currently. Uh, only one uh, like viral solution which we can uh, suggest to our customers. So uh, the devices have a pretty good battery life. So uh, what we can see is that some devices can work more than five years. Of course, we didn't get such results, but uh, the installations which we did like two years ago uh, still That's have... So like, 80% of uh, battery uh -huh. uh, range. Uh, range. Uh, it's uh, one of the most important things that you can have like one gateway, which will cover like, uh, I don't know, like 500 square meters in uh, capital building with uh, big walls uh, and uh, uh, you never get such results with any other t technology. Yeah. And uh, in the market, uh, a lot of different uh, types of the sensors. So uh, mm -hmm. as previously mentioned, there are like industrial one, which you can, for example, uh, have such type of wire and it will cover like a huge um, place. Uh, some um, some manufacturers also uh, 
provide special solutions for the data centers and uh, other industrial things. Uh, sure, it uh, can be pretty problematic because, uh, as you already uh, mentioned, that uh, that uh, we tested a lot of them. So I think uh, we tested more than twelve different uh, manufacturers of the uh, war equipment and. Uh, not everything uh, as straightforward, 